Hey there guys, it's Amanda. Thank you for coming by my channel today. I truly appreciate it. Today's video is special because it is part of a collab. It is a comfort food collab and it is hosted by DIY from House to Home Kitchen Edition. So make sure you go over and check her channel out. She's got a lot of good yummy recipes and please make sure that you check out the playlist listed below for all the other creators that are making content for this collab as well. So you'll want to start off with a 9 by 13 inch pan and you're going to spray it with nonstick cooking spray and then you're going to take a 16 ounce package of frozen pierogies and put them in a single layer on the bottom of the pan and then I took my sausage and I cut it up into bite sized pieces and I put that on top of the frozen pierogies. In the recipe they said that you could microwave these beforehand um, so they're kind of cooked prior to going into the oven but I kind of want to make this as easy as possible so I just threw the frozen ones in. Then in a bowl, you're going to want to add your cream cheese, your chicken broth, your sour cream, your pepper, and half of your shredded cheddar cheese. And this time, if you would want to add any more seasonings, you can. I actually added parsley, onion powder, and a spoonful of minced garlic to it. Um, and I did add quite a bit of black pepper, but that's because we do love pepper in this house. I do want to mention that I did add a little bit more sour cream and probably about five to six ounces of cream cheese instead of what the recipe called for which was four but you're going to want to make sure that you mix everything in the bowl really well and then you're going to pour it over your sausage and pierogies that are in the pan. I would just like to take a moment out and say thank you to everyone who is watching my video today. I truly appreciate it. If you're new or coming over from the collab, welcome. I'm Amanda and on my channel I normally am making pretty easy recipes and trying to spread meal inspiration so if that interests you, please don't forget to subscribe. I'd love it if you join my little YouTube family. Once you have all your sauce on top of your sausages and your pierogies, you're going to just want to smooth it out just to make sure that everything's covered. Then you're going to put foil on top of your pan and put it in a 375 degree oven for about 40 to 45 minutes until the internal temperature reaches 165 because you want to make sure that it's thoroughly cooked. And after the 40 to 45 minutes in the oven, you're going to want to take your other half cup of your cheese and sprinkle that over the top. And if you want to add a little bit more cheese, you know, I don't blame you, but just pop it back into the oven uncovered for about three to five minutes until that cheese is melted. And here it is guys, right out of the oven. It's all cheesy and gooey and everything that I like my comfort foods to be. So I hope you guys will give it a try. We had it as leftovers and it was awesome still. Um, I do thank you for coming by my channel today and watching my video. It means a lot. And I hope you'll like, comment, and subscribe and hit that notification bell. I truly appreciate it. And I hope you all have a wonderfully awesome, amazing day.